Angel Talia Chapter 5 On the Chase The 16th of October, 2012 The brothers are on the run. They are tracking down a suspect. Another demon worker, or slave. Dude, you think they would know anything about this incident? Alfred asks, trying to keep up. Matthew replies, If they are always kept in the loop, then there's no question they're bound to know something. They ran across a large bridge where the gateway from trying to escape, but the brothers are quickly to catch up. Matthew woke up early for a shower, while Sarah was out buying supplies. After cleaning himself, he got dressed in his usual police suit, and he goes into the kitchen for a coffee. Unbeknownst to him, Alfred was leaning against the arch to the kitchen. Morning! He burst, making Matthew jump. For God's sake, Al, don't do that to me. Matthew puffs out in annoyance. Alfred just chuckles. Alfred takes a sip out of the coffee. Matthew turns on the TV. So, what brings you here then? Matthew asks politely. Alfred shrugs his shoulders. Well, turns out that the chief of police hasn't arrived at work yet, so I came over to see ya before we had to go. Alfred's sentence drifts as Matthew's attention shifted to the report on the news. A group of unknown beings have been sighted in the streets near Central Park and kidnapped one victim and held another shoppers and workers hostage. Then a picture of the kidnapped victim appeared on the screen. Matthew's eyes widened. He placed his mugs on the table. It was Sarah. She's been kidnapped by these beings. Alfred looks at the TV and realizes what's going on. DUDE! Sarah's in trouble, isn't she? But Alfred knows that Matthew just vanished like that. Suddenly, Matthew shouts, Alfred, come on! Alfred jumps and rushes out of the house, locking the door behind him. Nikolai was cornered. Alfred and Matthew had their guns pointed at him. Come on, dude. Tell us where she is. Alfred's expression was furrowed, just like Matthew's. The man just kneeled down in defeat. Matthew stomps over closer and grabs the demon by the shoulder. Answer me! Where is Sarah? His tone was very serious. Why? Well, who's going to kill me anyway? The man shouted in panic. Not necessarily, Alfred pointed out. But we would have to take you into custody, Alfred adds onto his own sentence. Nikolai bowed his head. Find the find. They've taken her to a station, a metro station, near bridge. I think it was Brooklyn Bridge. Alfred knows where the station is. Dude, I know which one he means. Matthew nods. All right then. They grabbed a man and chained him to a pipe and let the police know of the suspect's location. The chains were not easy to destroy, but of course the demon was sneaky and he knew a way to escape the situation. Alfred and Matthew then got into a car and drove to where Matthew's girlfriend had been taken to. A mysterious man with a waistcoat and one wing watched from a tall building, keeping a watchful eye on the brothers as they drove away. Mm-hmm. <laughs>